Hi guys. So we have this question in the sound waves. Let's see how we can break it down. So if this one is standing one meter from a loudspeaker, here's a sound at an intensity of uh, nine times ten to the power negative three watts per square meter. So find its corresponding level of intensity. Okay. So to find the level of intensity, we have to say uh, beta, which represents the level of intensity, is equals to ten the logarithm of the intensity over the threshold of intensity. Like that. So now the threshold of intensity is a standard value of course. So beta will be equals to 10 log. So the intensity given is this value here, which is 9 times 10 to the power negative 3 over the threshold of intensity, which is 1 times 10 to the power negative 12. So what do we get as our sound level of intensity? So if we compute what we have, we should get 99.54. Now, the level of intensity is measured in decibels. Okay. For the second part, we are saying that, uh, assuming that it propagates from the source as perfect wave, so since it propagates for the spherical wave, meaning that it's going in all directions, find the sound intensity of four centimeters from the peso and its decibel level. So it's important to note that intensity, which propagates in all directions, is given by the formula P over uh, four pi r squared. Okay, r being uh, the radius from where the sound is coming from. Now, in this case, I'd like to say, let's say this is intensity one. The intensity we've been given, and let's say this is R1, the radius we've been given, which is one meter. So meaning that we're going to need another formula for the same, which is I2 is equals to power over four pi R2 squared. Okay. So assuming that the same power is being uh, emitted, what we're going to do is we're going to make part of the subject of the formula and compare the two formulas like this. If I cross multiply, I'll have power being equals to intensity one or pi r1 squared. Same thing here, if I cross multiply, power is equals to intensity two uh, or pi r2 squared. Okay, remember, we are first three looking for the sound intensity. Since the power is the same, we're going to compare these two. So this formula is equal to this. And if we do that, we'll have I1, four pi R1 squared. This is equals to I2, four pi R2 squared. We are looking for the second sound intensity, which is this I2 that we have here. So if we divide everything by I2, we shall get, uh, we'll say divided by four pi. We're dividing everything by whatever we have here, not I2. So four pi R2 squared, same thing here, four pi R2 squared. So all this will cancel out, leaving us with only I2. On this side, four cancels, pi cancels. So what do we remain with? We remain with intensity one times R1 squared divided by R2 squared. Okay. Now, in this case, uh, we can say we find the intensity two. Intensity one, we've been given in the question, it's this one here. So intensity one is nine times 10 to the power negative three. Radius one, again, we're given in the question, it's uh, one meter. So that's just one squared. All this is divided by the radius two is 45 centimeters. But if we convert it to meters, then this will be 0 0.45 meters. But remember, the R has a square. Okay. So now with this, let's see what we get as our intensity. So if we compute this, our intensity will seem to be 0 0.45. 
0 0.044 watts per square meter. Now, in standard form, uh, this is just 4.4 4.4 times 10 to the power negative 2. Okay. Let's do this. I hope it's visible now. So, uh, this is our the intensity too that we're looking for. But remember, the question says we need to find its decibel level as well. So to find the decibel level, we're going to use the same formula that we had there. So uh, the decibel level will be found by beta is equals to 10, the logarithm of I2 this time around, over I0, which is the threshold of intensity. So 10 log intensity 2 is... 0 0.044 divided by the threshold of intensity, which is 1 times 10 to the power negative 12. And this will give us a decibel level of 106.43 decibels. Okay, there we have it. I hope it makes sense. In case you have a question, please feel free to drop it in the comments. Otherwise, thank you very much.